During the years of our lords, the Holy Sword Knights would pass through the village of Nudon, only to discover businesses of vice, alcohol, pleasure, all despised by the Holy Sword Knights. Bo was a mercenary, working hard to get enough money to leave Nudon with her lover Alina, who worked at Nudon's brothel to help earn enough to leave with her. Alina was stuck inside as the building was burnt down, the Holy Sword Knights trapping the workers inside, spouting their dogma of rejection of bodily vice and finding the first hero's sword. Bo had been on a job, off in the woods hunting lesser ghouls and mutants, and returned to Nudon for her pay, only to find most of the village in shambles. When she found out what had happened, oh how she wept. But that sorrow was tainted with a single drop of anger, until it dyed it red with a desire for revenge. She headed to the town's blacksmith, a mysterious man who kept to himself. She took the money she and Alina had set aside, and requested a blade that was thick enough to cleave through Holy Sword Knight's armour. The large, inch-wide, cleaver-like blade was what she was given, a blade for slaying the armoured soldiers of the Holy Sword Knights, and the Night Killer lived up to its name. No matter how much it chipped, no matter rain or mud, bone or blood, no level of wear nor friction broke her blade, and she tore through Holy Sword Knight's armour with only a single swing, cleaving armour and rending flesh. One would think that the Night Killer's quest would be possible, but the Holy Sword Knights grew faster than Bo could cut them down, for she was only one person against an army that felt like it multiplied every month. This never-ending pile of knights weigh heavy on Bo's soul, and during a fight against fifteen men, she would finally be claimed by frenzy. Throwing herself at her foes, splitting their skulls, shattering their bones, victory brought her no clarity for Frenzy had her mind and soul grasped in its claws. She roams the night, slaying those who bear the crest of holy swords, the one she despises so primally she can never forget. Who knows if she still remembers why she started this journey, for Frenzy is a cruel thing and knows no mercy. <laughs>